my goodness! Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're diving into what feels like the future of coding. Cursor 2.0 just dropped and it's pushing vibe coding to the next level, where you don't just code, you collaborate with AIs like a real dev team. And yeah, we'll show how we're using it to build a real-time strategy game with tank battles from scratch. Let's dive in. So guys, let's dive in into this new vibe coding thing. Does it even work? Cursor 2.0 introduces a new agents view. It's like command central for developers. Instead of one chat, you've got multiple AIs working side by side. One builds terrain, another scripts the tanks, another tweaks UI. You describe the vibe of the project and they code it together live. So the most important is the new Cursor 2.0 is not just hand managing the files old school way. Instead, we use a new agents view where you run multiple AI devs at once. So I am trying to make an RTS game again. And this time one agent builds terrain, another scripts movement logic, another spawns explosions when tanks fire. You just describe what you want, add a bridge and let tanks cross it. And the AI handles the full code update in seconds. We built a working RTS prototype we call mini wars in just a matter of minutes. Red and blue tanks clash on a stylized low poly map. You can drag to select units, right click to move, and even hit space for particle explosions. Cursor handled everything from the grid map and bridge geometry to the smooth color layers and UI bar. It's surreal watching the scene form in real time, like the AI is sculpting the game right in front of you. If you stumble into errors, it will fix it as well and let you apply changes. The new Composer 1 model makes it all possible. It's way faster than the old Cheetah build and can edit multiple files instantly. When we told it to add artillery units and a nuke countdown, it generated the logic, visuals, and UI buttons all at once. No lag, no confusion. Now let's compare. Lovable is smoother for quick UI prototypes, but forgets previous states too easily, breaking progress when you continue a big project. Claude Code is great at structured logic, but too slow for creative iteration. Cursor 2.0 remembers every file, understands project layout, and keeps the flow alive. That's why vibe coding actually works here. But let's be real for a second, guys. Here's the real talk. Vibe coding isn't perfect. Multiple agents can collide. One AI might optimize a function while another deletes the same line. Some sessions end with a broken build because two agents tried to fix the same bug differently. It's powerful, but unpredictable. You get bursts of genius and sometimes complete chaos. You've got to guide the flow, not just vibe and hope. Still, when it works, it's like creative electricity. You describe your idea, make red and blue tanks fight with particle explosions. And within minutes, the map, units, and effects are all alive. That's Cursor 2.0, fast, visual, and thrillingly experimental. Next up, we're putting Cursor, Lovable, and Claude in a direct AI dev showdown. Who builds the better RTS prototype? Subscribe so you don't miss it. 